So I think we'll leave you with uh, two questions, uh, and hopefully uh, my colleagues on the panel will help address them. One is, what is the opportunity? What's the Indian market looking like? Uh, what can we do differently? And by the way, what's the whole story around analytics and big data, and what's the role that India can play? If you look at the return on investment on one hand and the spend that happens typically on something like big data, uh, you'll realize that different industries have leveraged that. So in some cases, the spends have been low and suck about 30 minutes uh, between the panelists and um, you know have almost in the next 30 uh, to have the conversation, have some good questions. So I'm hoping uh, you are geared with your questions. Uh, we do want to talk a bit about the India advantage. Uh, for me, the journey is almost like peeling the onion. The more you start peeling, especially in the analytics space, the more insights you get. So how do you drive some of that? How do you turn insights into action? Uh, so the favorite example that we often talk in the banking industry is, you know, we drive so much of data. I exactly know, uh, you know, who, which individual withdraws money on a Friday evening. I exactly know from the card statement what does that individual or which power. What I don't know is what does he do after that. Right? And so how do you bring in uh, that insight uh, around and leverage and create that value for your customers is a big piece. So insights into an action would be the other perspective. There are challenges. Uh, there are challenges. And I'll speak some about the banking industry. And I, I will have my colleagues uh, speak a little bit. And of course, India opportunity, why we are all here. So again, the, the mark of how do you get that 700 million uh, to you know, 7 billion, and can we do it faster and earlier, and maybe even bigger. So I'm going to leave some thoughts uh, in the banking space, uh, generic banking, the world of banking. I think one of the things that we play a lot is the data, data in silos, data across products, businesses, divisions, segments. Uh, how do we leverage some of that, uh, you know, consumer being at the heart? Uh, the amount of information that we collect, how do you bring that relevant uh, information uh, to the table? We would like to talk about ownership and sharing. So for example, if I move away from banking uh, into a space uh, like you know, uh, pharmacy industry, and, and you know, Dinesh, uh, something for you to talk about maybe, you know, hospital data, so very personal to an individual. How do you leverage that information uh, and, and yet not cross the, the boundaries of uh, confidentiality? Uh, so something for, for us to talk about, and uh, you know, uh, again, we'll hear our colleagues speak about. Uh, a big chunk around uh, technology hurdles. So what are the hurdles? What's the size, scope, data, connectivity, uh, you know, the whole world of digital and social media, uh, and you know, the, the small brick mortar kind of business is changing into this online electronic at all time uh, behavior. How do we handle some of that? Uh, and I was talking to a colleague uh, some time back, and a very interesting insight, right? So everybody wanted to know what the mobile service providers do, and who are they, and where do they live, and how can you make them an offer, and stuff like that.